be quite honest, I'm not too sure where we're going, but. Dude, this is cool. Holy crap. Dude, look at this. Huh. I don't, I'm gonna check this out real quick. We're gonna set everything down right here. There is a fish right there. There is a fish right there. No, but we can't get down. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There's two guys right there. But. Yeah, okay. Never mind. Okay. So. That was awkward. <laughs> that's what that, that's what that lure was. That cast right in front of us, but, um, you just want to walk across the bridge and go over there, because that's where we fished last time, we know it, so, all right, let's do that. I'm scary, come here. She's about to freak out. Oh my God. <laughs> See all this fur right here? <laughs> Everywhere. Yeah. Coyote probably killed something right here and ate it. It smells. All right, yeah, we're going across the other side. If you don't have a girlfriend like this, I don't know what you're doing. All right, this is where me and Cole fished. I don't think I've ever fished in a cooler spot though. This is so this is actually, this is insanely cool. It still doesn't hit the bottom. I got something. I feel it, I think. Yep. Giant, giant white bass already. Really? You see that thing? Can we use it for um, I don't think so. Well, heck yeah, guys. I already caught a dang white bass. Okay, did any of these fish bite? I've never caught one of these. All right, guys, just caught this in the cast net already. Um, trying a new spot with my girlfriend here on Great Miami River. Um, and yeah, caught this in the cast net. I don't think we can use these as bait, but throw them back. Hopefully get another fish in here. And a little bit later, we're going to throw a spoon and try to catch some of these guys. So you guys stay tuned. Uh, this is the best intro of the thing already. We're already catching fish here. But apparently these things are really good eating. So, But we're, we're throwing them back today. It's a really cool fish. We got a really steep bank here, but we got... Um, we got structure in the water, uh, and it's deep, so that's perfect for flatheads, and maybe we'll catch some big, big boys of these and hybrids. So, stay tuned, guys. Really bad video. Not, 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 not by you, but like I was like shaking my head. You weren't. And like I. Hopefully this gets us something. What? Hopefully this gets us something. Darn. We probably shouldn't have tried to get bait in the same spot we're fishing, but. That would have been such a good cast if it didn't hit the tree. Someone else's bait that they lost. Ew, my mm -mm. skills I just caught just this. Came off of me. Let's 
Oh my God. Let's go. Bait for the day. Freaking finally. Shit. Bait for the day. Maybe for the day I'll still throw. But. Hey. All right, we gotta get water in this bucket somehow. In the water. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna need you to pull it to me, okay? Because when you're pulling it, it sucks the bottom up. That's how the cast nets work. Oh. And like to get all the fish out and stuff, you have to pull the top up. Exactly. Okay. And now I'm just muddy, but it doesn't really. Well, I just don't want to get in your car like that, but. I might just have stuff attached to it. I don't know. Is it going? Mm -hmm. You can at least try. Recast if you have to. Yeah. What do you think? Nothing? Fish? No. No? Mm -hmm. down right there oh yeah one two three four five six oh it may have been a turtle i think it i think it was a turtle the way it took it down but the way that rod's looking right there it kind of looks like something's pulling that too Yes, right in front of me too. Y'all, so we got three poles out right now. Um, we just been getting gunk on all of them. I actually had a live bait set up on my spinning rod and with a bobber. I think a turtle took it under or something. I got that on GoPro, you guys saw that. But we've got just about 30 minutes left to fish here and we still haven't caught anything. So a while ago, a while back in the summer, we did really good here, but we just tried to test this spot out. It also may not be a good spot. We can try a different spot next time we come, but it's not really working. Well, we did catch that white bass, but yeah, right now it's not doing that well. Um, even with bait, we are struggling, so uh, maybe we'll get some here in the next 30 minutes, but if not, we'll just be back sometime else and try to get on a catfish. So at least we caught a white bass. That was actually my first white bass I've ever caught, which doesn't really count because it's in the cast net, but it still kind of counts for me. So, stay tuned. Fish on that. Giant tree. God. I still thought we had a fish, dude. I'm so done with this. No. So, huh? No. You ready? Yeah. This could be the final finale right here. Might be able to end on this fish. And it's nothing. Well, we broke off about 20 times. Caught nothing. Well, we caught the white bass, so that's okay. That's okay. This, this was just cool.
I was stuck under a wood thing and I got really excited. Holy shoot. No, I did. I... Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Something had it and was just running with its body. <laughs> I I am going to die. Like I, I'm about to be so mad. Do you not understand what just happened to us? Do we have another minnow? Dude, I, we have to go, but like <laughs> I'm so mad Let right now. Do you see this? Ew, babe, it's on you. Do you see that? Oh my freaking gosh. Something just. <laughs> that's definitely a gar, anyway, probably. But it's a gar. What a really toothy fish. That is so funny that it literally, like, did not touch the hook, but took everything. Yes. Literally. All right, guys. Well, that is gonna end it for today. Uh, we did not catch anything except that white bass. Uh, still a pretty fun day, but sorry for not a lot of action. It was still a good time. Um, probably gonna make a video out of this. It'll be a short one, but you guys stay tuned. Keep watching. Uh, should be some good videos coming up. It's spring break right now, so stay tuned. Peace out, y'all.